This video is an explanation of the college recruiting process and the subtleties of applying to college for both academics and athletics. My advice to any college prospective student athletes is just to begin the process as early as possible uh, to get organized and kind of to gather the facts together because the earlier in your high school career that you start planning for college and planning for recruiting, the easier and less stressful it's going to be down the road uh, when you're trying to figure out where you want to end up. The coach will look at your physical ability. If he believes your size and skills can translate well to college baseball, he will be interested in recruiting you. Coaches also look at grades and SAT and ACT scores. That is essential in getting into the school. Coaches also look at high school stats. If your coach can list your stats on maxprep.com, it provides an easy way for college coaches to see the stats and track how you're doing during your season. The recruiting questionnaire is an online form that all college baseball programs have to gather information about their prospective student athletes. The form can be found on any specific college's college baseball website under prospective students or prospective student athletes and is a really quick, free, and three to five minute form to fill out that everybody needs to fill out if they want to play college baseball at school. It lets the coach know how interested a student athlete is in their program and will just give them the information they need in order to begin recruiting them. You're going to need a good enough GPA in order to play baseball at these colleges and actually get admitted into the colleges. Every high school has a minimum GPA requirement of usually 2.0 uh, in order to play baseball that you need. Uh, the next thing you're going to need is a uh, standardized test, whether it be the SAT or the ACT. Every college kid has to do it. And the next thing is not to get arrested. This is a huge thing because on every recruiting questionnaire that you fill out, there's going to be a question asking if you have any legal issues. And it's, it is asked by the college coaches just because it shows if you respect your community and reveals your character, which is a big thing that they're looking for. And the last thing is, if you want to play D1 baseball, you have to register with the NCAA Clearinghouse on the NCAA Eligibility Center online. And it basically just verifies your test scores and your grades so college coaches know that you are legit.